Hello, Nick Hodges, the Delphi product manager here, and we're going to talk today about Rad Studio. We're going to take a look at what Rad Studio is, what it contains, and many of its new features. And uh, if we have time at the end, we'll do some demoing. So here's our definition statement for Rad Studio. Uh, Rad Studio is basically a compilation of three uh, products put together into a single package, two products for native development, specifically Delphi and C++ Builder. Uh, both of those tools are already available for single purchase, but now they're being bundled together into a single Rad Studio. Both of those run in the Galileo IDE built by us. And they are both available for building native Windows applications, native desktop, web, database, middle tier, web server applications of any sort that you really, anything you want to do on Windows, you pretty much can do it with uh, Delphi and C++ Builder. Rad Studio also includes uh, the new tool that we're announcing this week, uh, releasing uh, with it, is Delphi Prism, which is a managed development, .NET development which focuses on managed code using the CLR platform, whether that be the .NET platform or the Mono platform running on the Mac and Linux. So all three of those products together combine into a single product called Rad Studio 2009. Now, before we get started, let's talk about some basic reasons why you'd want to upgrade. There's some reasons here, and we'll talk about a few of them. First one is uh, you might want to upgrade to Rad Studio 2009 to expand your business into global markets. On the native side, and indeed on the .NET side as well with Prism, all the entire product is Unicode enabled. You can build applications with Delphi, C++ Builder, and Prism that are Unicode capable, that consume and produce Unicode data, that process and manage Unicode data. You can also translate and display, translate your applications so that they display Unicode data in the button captions and labels and uh, list boxes and all your controls. The entire product is Unicode enabled. In addition, the enhanced localization tools will enable you to translate your applications to other languages and alphabets. Also, for Rad Studio 2009, uh, we've put a lot of emphasis on connectivity via the uh, new framework inside of DataSnap, the multi-tiered database connectivity called DataSnap. And in addition, we've updated our COM support to provide new and more powerful COM creation and management. We'll talk about that a little bit later. 